followers. Uh, this is just a quick one uh, be because I, as I've done at the beginning of the season, I gave my predictions of how each driver and each team is gonna do at at of at the beginning of the 2017 season. I did the same um, uh, when Jensen Button replaced um, Fernando Alonso, um, and now I'm gonna do it uh, because Pierre Ga Pierre Gasly. Pierre Gasly is gonna re replace um, Daniel Kvyat for at least two Grand Prix from the from the this week's this weekend's Malaysian Grand Prix onwards. So um, to be honest with you, I don't really know how he's gonna do because. Um, I I don't know I don't really follow the kid um, so I've got no idea what what he's like as a racing driver um, but from what I gather he's from what I've read and from what I heard he's pretty pretty all right in the in the um, in the low formulas although not a not a bright uh, not an outstanding driver from what I gather. Uh, I personally think it's wrong of Toro Rosso to or um, to um, put Daniel Kvyat on the sidelines again because I think it's a, a double uh, demotion because um, they done it once. Remember when they when they replaced um, Daniel Kvyat uh, with Max Verstappen, and I think it's a double it's a double blow. It's another kick in the stomach for for Daniel Kvyat, um, and I think they just playing with him because they can't get rid of they can't get rid of him because they need him for um next they need him for Austin this year because Pierre Gasly is is, is apparently going for the championship in a super formula in a super formula in Japan uh, so they they need him to race um the uh, in that in that uh, Grand Prix, uh, they need him to race in. Uh, they need Daniel Kvyat to race in. In the, I think it's the Austin Grand Prix, uh, and I also think they're gonna need him for next year uh, because of Carlos Sainz. Uh, baggering off for uh, to Renault. So, uh, but if I was if I was Daniel Kvyat, I would I would tell I would tell Toro Russell where to go because I I don't think it's it. Um, I I would I would want to be associated with Red Bull or Toro Russell because I think what's their management the way that they treat their drivers is absolutely diabolical uh, let me know what you think um, in the comment section below anyway guys this has been it I've been Razam at one there won't be a qualifying um, summary uh, this weekend because I'm going to go and watch the, fo the football with my mate uh, Warren um, so and and the 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 race the the, the race um, uh, summary might be a bit delayed. Okay, uh, probably Monday or Tuesday or I try and get it out on 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 uh, 
Sunday, but latest on Tuesday. All right. Anyway, I would like to uh, grab your attention for one second. And I have now got a Patreon site where you can uh, just support me and um, and um, from, you know, show your gratitude. Like, if you like what I do, um, then uh, why not become a patron? Uh, in return, I will, uh, if I get enough, if I get... Uh, any any patrons then I will may, uh, put a list uh, put you in a thank you message in every f future video that I do so um, you know it doesn't you know my first love uh, is Formula One and that's the reason why I do it um, yeah so you know um, so but if you like what you see then uh, just you can now become my patron. So uh, I look forward to see your support, and I'll see you on uh, on. Uh, I'll see you for the race, Malaysian race review, very soon. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.